Well, it's been a week now since we released the Lost River DLC map. A lot of people have purchased it. Thank you very much. A lot of people are playing it and um, looks like generally having a good time. So that's very fun to see. It's just a quick devlog to say that we have now added the new music from the Lost River DLC map to the Wolf Quest original soundtrack and also to the old Music Extras DLC pack. This consists of nine new tracks, all composed and performed by Tim Buzza, which in the game play when you're exploring the human areas of the map and a few other select locations. We think Tim, once again, hit it out of the park with these tracks. And from what we've heard, a lot of you agree with that. This does include one track that you uh, haven't heard in the game yet. There's a number of things that we just weren't able to get into Lost River in time for this release. So we'll be adding those in the next month or two and uh, you'll see how it gets used then. The soundtrack now has over three hours of music, still $10, so no worries if you haven't purchased it yet, the price isn't going up, and uh, we hope you enjoy it. One other thing, we have begun adding some Lost River merchandise to our Redbubble store. If you want to get those, uh, those Lost Cup coffee shop catastrophe images, they're on mugs and various other products now. You can also get the beautiful Lost River Town sign painting that uh, longtime Wolf Quest player and artist Roland made for us. And some of the achievements that Loach has made. We'll be adding more in the future, but we do have some of them on, uh, on stuff now. And of course, some of the new Lost River dreams that Susan made. So check that out. So once again, thank you everyone for your support of Wolf Quest. Over this year and, and years past, we're going strong and we got lots of good stuff coming in the future. So stay with us.